satellites are humanity's assistance in space. Working far beyond the reach of our planet's atmosphere, they provide communication, internet access, broadcasting, navigation and imaging services. Any such services are made possible by a specific set of equipment called a payload. Sending this equipment off to space is the reason why satellites are built in the first place. What kinds of equipment go into the payload depends on the satellite's purpose. The main part of any communication satellite's payload is an onboard signal repeater, as well as antenna and feed equipment for signal reception and transmission. Satellites performing special tasks are equipped with special payload components. As such, GLONASS system satellites perform their navigation function using not only an RF signal transmitter, aka an onboard navigation signal transmitter, but also a frequency standard. A frequency standard is a clock that keeps time with the highest accuracy. It has an error of one second in 30 million years. The time transmitted by the navigation satellite as part of the radio signal allows users on Earth to determine their coordinates with high accuracy. Geodesy spacecraft implement various measurement instruments. Among them, special emphasis is put on the radio altimeter that determines the exact distance from the spacecraft in orbit to the Earth or water surface. Satellites designed for scientific research are equipped with scientific instruments, as well as photo and video cameras. Thus, spacecraft payloads are diverse. They include electronic units, antenna systems and optical reflectors. In Russia, they are manufactured by various enterprises of space industry. Here at Reshitnov, we too put a special emphasis on payload development. After all, the majority of Russian satellites providing communications, data relay, navigation and geodesy services are built here.